All right. Good evening. Welcome to the Los Banos City Council special meeting of November the 10th, 2021. The City Hall Council Chambers remain closed to the public. In accordance with Assembly Bill 361, all members of the City Council and City staff will join the meeting via phone, video conference, and no teleconference locations are required. Following alternatives are available to members of the public who wish to watch the meeting and or provide comments to the City Council before and during the meeting. Audio video broadcast, a City Council meeting can be accessed in real time from your computer, your tablet, or your smartphone at the Zoom link provided on the agenda. Comment during a public meeting. Uh, public comments will be taken at the time of each eligible agenda item. If you would like to submit written comments, submit written comments by email, cityclerk at lospanis.org, or drop them off at City Hall at 520 J Street. If you are a Zoom video conference participant, to comment by Zoom video conference, click the raise your hand button to request to speak when public comment is being taken on an eligible agenda item. You will then be unmuted during your turn and allowed to make public comments. After the allotted time, you will then be re-muted. If you're a phone participant, participant to comment by phone, please call on one of the above listed numbers. You will be prompted to raise your hand by pressing star nine to request to speak when public comment is being taken on an eligible agenda item. You will then be unmuted during your turn and allowed to make public comments. Then press star six to unmute yourself in order to speak. After the allotted time, you will then be re-muted. Instructions on how to join a Zoom meeting by phone are available at Los Banas's Zoom, uh, Los Banas website with the Zoom information uh, there. Important things to remember during the public comment period, all attendees shall be muted upon entry to the meeting. Please do not raise your hand if the item currently being heard is not the item you wish to speak on. We will call for public testimony on each item individually. When the item you are interested in is called and public speakers are invited to raise their hands, please raise yours and then we will call them in all in the order they are raised. You may, of course, speak on multiple items, but your comments during each item must address the item currently under discussion. Speakers attempting to speak about items other than the item currently under consideration will be muted and asked to wait for the item they're here to speak about to be called. So now we will call the meeting to order at 6.07 p.m. And we will ask Police Commander Reyna to lead us in the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you, Commander. Now we will go to roll call. Ms. Malley? Jones? Present. Lambert? Here. Um, let me unmute her. Lewis? Council Member Lewis? There she Here. Is. Lamas. Here. Korea. Here. We have a quorum. We'll now move on to consideration of approval of the agenda. Do I have a motion? Mayor Councilmember Lambert, make a motion to approve the agenda as read. Thank you. Do I have a second? Mr. Mayor. I'll second that. Thank you. I have a motion by Council Member Lambert and a second by Council Member Yamas to approve the agenda as submitted. Ms. Maloney, roll call, please. Jones. Yes. Lambert. Yes. Lewis. Yeah. Lamas. Yes. Maria. Yes. Agenda has been approved unanimously. 
Item five, public forum. Members of the public may address the city council members on any item of public interest that is within the jurisdiction of the city council. This includes agenda and non-agenda items. No action will be taken on non-agenda items. Speakers may submit their comments by submitting a written statement limited to 250 words or less by dropping it off at the utility payment box at City Hall 520 J Street by mail or email at cityclerk at lospanis.org. Comments received will be read into the record during the city council meeting. Ms. Maloney, do we have any public forum comments this evening? Um, I do have one email that I did receive that they asked me to read it into the record. Okay, please. Um, the Los Spanish Chamber of Commerce would like to announce that we will be hosting the annual Christmas parade this year on Friday, December 3rd, 2021. This year's theme will be rocking around a community strong Christmas, featuring the original Los Banas Santa Franklin. To be an entry in the Christmas parade, please contact the chamber for an application. The chamber would like to welcome grocery outlets, Jungle Gym's Adventure Lane, Central Valley Visitation Solutions, Heartful Home Designs, Los Banas Martial Arts, and Touche Beauty Company as new members to the Los Spanish Chamber of Commerce. We are always looking for new chamber ambassadors, someone willing to attend ribbon cuttings, mixers, chamber events, and be part of the chamber to help support local business members in the Los Spanish community. So we would like to invite anyone who is interested to come to the chamber office, 932 6th Street downtown, to get more information about becoming a chamber ambassador. Hope to see everyone down at the Christmas parade. And it's from Michelle M. Sandoval, the executive director of the Los Banas Chamber of Commerce. And those are the only comments I received. Thank you, Ms. Mallon. With that, we will close the public forum. Go to item six. Council will be going into closed session. We have a conference with labor negotiators pursuant to government code section 54957.6, agency designated representatives, city manager Pinero, city attorney Vaughn, human resources director Maloney, finance director Williams, legal counsel Tufo, and employee organizations, Los Banas Police Officers Association. We'll now go to closed session and then we'll report out after uh, when we return. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. Have a good evening. Okay, um, and uh, I believe, uh, well, we've come out of closed session and uh, I believe we have direction to staff. Is that correct, Mr. Vaughn? Yes, no reportable action other than that. And no reportable action other than that, and then direction to staff. Um, and before I ask for a motion to adjourn, I wanna uh, particularly note uh, our veterans here today Mr. Yamas, Mr. Lambert, tomorrow is your day. We honor you. And Mr. Yamas, happy birthday to the Marine Corps today. Uh, we thank you all for your service. So, Chair will entertain a motion to adjourn. Mr. Mayor Yamas, I move to adjourn. Thank you, Mr. Yamas. Do I have a second? Mayor, Councilmember Jones, second that. Thank you, Mr. Jones. I have a motion by Councilmember Yamas. Second by Councilmember Jones to adjourn the meeting. And Ms. Melanie, roll call. Jones. Yes. Lambert. Yes. Lewis. Yes. Lamas. Yes. Faria. Yes. Motion carried unanimously. Meeting adjourned at 6.45 p.m. Take care, everyone. Have a wonderful Veterans Day. Bye-bye.